Dude, play this game. We are in the city, going around, looking at our nice suit, doing a quick recap, because maybe, maybe it's been some time. Not to date the episode or anything, but Red Dead 2 has come out, <laughs> and so has Super Mario Party, which Super Mario Party is so fun. I, I know it's we're supposed to be talking about Spider-Man, um, before I randomly start talking about Super Mario Party, where are we supposed to be going? We are supposed to be going wherever the map is telling us, but I don't see... I don't see anything. Okay, um, so Super Mario Party, really fun, definitely recommend Red Dead copy gets here later so hopefully it's good I've seen reviews on it yeah but yeah let's get back to talking about spider-man let's you know do the actual seeing the spider-man let's wait for someone to tell us what to do yeah well uh well we're getting a phone call so maybe it'll finally actually tell us where we're going and I can just stop aimlessly swimming around Although we it's really fun. probably need a little practice. I mean, I don't. <laughs> the DLC. I don't because I'm the, the the uh, one of one of the other things that came out recently was the uh, first of Spider-Man's many DLCs, and by many I mean three. And hopefully um, by the time this video comes out, the others are already out. <laughs> yeah, the the first DLC, the heist, involves Black Cat, and it is really good because I beat the game. Uh, a while back on my personal file and started playing the DLC. Oh, no, oh one of the birds. I missed it. Get that pigeon. I'm going. I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> no. Pigeons eat spiders. Well, maybe. Oh dear. Okay, there he is. There he is. You got him. Okay. Pigeon found. Oh wow, we're almost done with the pigeons. Are we really? Three more. Three more. Oh wow. No, I have not been grinding or doing anything on this game. Yeah, that's just a that's just a byproduct of going it's around a... reactive. Oh. Crime. Crime. Who said there's allowed to be crimes in my city? I, uh, oh yeah, I, I'm, I gonna guess to, that's kind of I'm gonna have to, to learn about the combat again. Uh, quick question, how do I do my super ability? Uh, uh, super? It's pressed down on the sticks. Because I remember that being helpful. <laughs> Very helpful. Wait a minute. Who, who am I attacking right now? You are attacking demons. Martin Lee's uh, What does that... I mean, I'm sorry. Mr. Negatives. Lackeys. Okay. So I'm not, not fighting really police officers. Sorry. Got it. No, you're not fighting cops. Uh, Alright. You... <laughs> One thing that was mentioned about this game that I kind of agree with is that uh, the auto-targeting is a little janky when it comes to, like, fights in the game. Like, it can sometimes get in the way where you'll be trying to you'll be trying to web up a specific enemy and then somebody else will walk by and you'll just start attacking them. It'll be like, no, I don't want to fight you. <laughs> but, at get same, that guy. but at the same time, I can make the argument that it's, it flows. You don't feel like you have to disengage. Yeah. Well, there's really specific, especially in the DLC, there's really specific missions where you have to stop certain people uh, okay. in a big crowd of enemies. And it's like, I just want to stop that guy. Because if he leaves, then I lose. Oh, okay, so you have a very specific moment of this happening to you. Yeah. Whereas so far in this game, it really hasn't pushed Normally that. it doesn't, and I don't I don't know if it does in the main game, I don't remember. But I know it does in the DLC, and it makes it really aggravating. <laughs> but, I mean, otherwise it's, it's really fun. Oh, uh, completely unrelated Spider-Man question time. Fun. Okay, so I was listening to a stream... Possibly on Thursday, maybe on Wednesday. Completely forgot. Yeah. Anyway, people on the stream were talking about, like, you have a month to live in this room. Do you choose the room that's full of raw potatoes, or do you choose the room that's full of raw onions? Now, on the, on the stream, they were like, potatoes all the way. Like, why would you choose onions? And I'm like, seems fair. Like, raw potatoes, you could probably, like, live pretty long off just eating. 
yeah. uh, get him to work. Asked that question at work, everyone's like onions, and I was just completely blown away. Like everybody was like onions, and I was like, I thought it would be potatoes. I thought people would be like, I want to go into a potato room. So what's your thoughts? What would you choose? I would choose onions simply because they clean your teeth and potatoes don't. <laughs> you could take a bite out of raw onion and it would burn like crazy, but you'd still have teeth at the end of that month. If you're sitting there eating potatoes, that's a lot of starch. A lot you'd of get starch. fat and you'd have no teeth. Or, I mean, you'd still have teeth, but they'd, they'd have some serious wear and tear. Sorry, Both of them are edible and nutritious. It's just one tastes really bad. And the other just kind of tastes like starch until you cook it. So. On it. I got them stuck for a moment. No, I get why someone might choose potatoes, but I, I, I would actually choose onion. I mean, now granted, the, the question started off as, like, if you had to survive a day in this room, what would you choose? And they're like... Potatoes. A day, yeah, okay, a day. I would. And do. then, like, it kind of just got progressively more from that, and uh, sorry, I was looking at the thing. Okay, looks like I could optimize this. Pattern. And it got progressively more, and they started adding on like more time. And they were like, "I'm still gonna choose potatoes, man." Yeah, I don't know. I feel like after a really long time, I'd choose potatoes, but like. For for a middle amount of time, I think I'd choose onions. Because I think I'd start wanting to kill someone if I had to eat a million onions. You know? <laughs> a million? If, if I had to eat, like, a year's worth of onions or something, I'd, I'd cry. Wouldn't be very happy. That's where I have to get to, right? Yeah. Um, nope. Eat, nope. What? Because that's not going to connect like that. Oh, yeah, it's got to go. No. No, I'm not. I, I get... You fool. You fool. You absolute madman. Have you learned nothing from this? Do you... Uh, yeah, it is. There you go. All right. And then let's see if my math was right. It's wrong. <laughs> well, that's just... It's a shame. That's what happens. Your math is wrong, and... You get it all wrong. And nice. Okay, what next? Oh, I thought I had to do that in the time. Wait, <laughs> did I have to do that in the time? No. Okay. No. You could take 30 minutes to do that if you wanted. Looks like Are you saying you took 30 minutes to do it? I'm not answering that. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> yes. No, uh, I didn't actually take 30 minutes. I mean, it's okay. I would, I'm not going to judge you either way. We all right. cool. Man, it's good to not be sick, though. I, I ended up with the flu over the past couple weeks. Like, multiple times. I'd think I'd, I was done with it, and then I'd come back with the flu again. I'd be like, I had to keep calling in to work. Wrong one. Wait, what? Oh. Uh, minus two, not a minus one. So then that has to be a minus. No, just minus two, and then just reroute it over here. You're making it more. We talk oh, about. Oh yeah, no, 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 you're right. <laughs> I don't think I can. Unless I, I can. No, you can't. You can't edit it. I thought you could edit the normal one. I was like, why are you trying to reroute it? Why don't you just Finished. replace it? You just. I'm dumb. You just put it. <laughs> I didn't in. look at the. Uh... <laughs> so what are we fixing here? Uh, the neural interface of the helmet? Of the, of the, yeah. To the prosthetic. To the prosthetic? The prosthetic. That's, okay. that's definitely what it's working towards. I, there could have been a few things that it could have been towards. Um, oh, yeah. Like, uh... Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be nothing. perfectly honest, it's been a while in the game, so I was like, maybe we acquired something we're just doing some testing on. Nope. Um, why do we not see that as a straight? I mean, well, I don't think I don't think we've acquired anything. I don't know. Maybe. I don't think we acquired anything either. 
again, people who watch this video will be like, you didn't acquire anything, and they're just binge watching it, because that's the nature of kids these days. Just kids binge, these days. <laughs> to binge watch and stuff. And they're binge watching. I don't know, it was apparently like a Daredevil came out, like the new season. Five, six, dang it. And people have already binged, watched all of it's that. Gotta be, it's gotta be a different minus, not a different plus. Oh. So minus two. This is why I have you, the, you've got a math major and I can trust you on this stuff. A, a math major? Mm-hmm, to do simple addition on <laughs> yeah. the stuff when my brain don't work right. I think you're missing the final word in that in that little uh, in that little setup there. Uh, math major you. malfunction. <laughs> I, got it, Doc. The, I can't math do math to save my life. But you did it right then, and it saved. Good That's work. because it involves Spider Man. It involved all those life. <laughs> no, it, it just involves Spider Man, so I can do it. It's Spidey Man. I swear he's making so much progress on this without us. Yeah, if like three to five year old me was told get straight A's and graduate college for Spider-Man, I probably would have led a very different life. Full of Spider-Man. Someone told me to do it for Spider-Man. My life would be perfect. And, and see, so you question why I want the Pro, and it's because I hear that, and I'm like... The jet engine PS4? Yeah. Oh! That's a completely normal prosthetic. It's really <laughs> creepy, isn't it? It's <laughs> <laughs> the imagery right now. Also, Peter, you should probably still be next to the button. Yeah, a little bit. So, can you juggle just by thinking about it? Because if I don't know how to juggle, like, is it gonna? Yeah, Holy crap. it probably would cause a problem because this is doing what you're thinking. It, what you will it to do. But yeah, that's impressive, isn't it? Um... And probably impossible. I don't know if it's impossible. If it just goes high enough, I'm pretty Well, it's sure. not impossible in a, in a world where you got, I like, Spider-Man, Black yeah, like, like, Panther. It's not, it's not impossible in that, it's just... He did all of that, wow. Yeah. Do you need some help? Yes. Yeah. We need some help. Here's a big reveal coming up. It would be nice Doctor, if what's your going engine on? would quiet down a little bit. I mean, we can always just turn it on. It's become that obvious. Yeah. yeah. You can press on the plus. It's My not that big call deal. It a degenerative neurological disorder. I think the best part of the jet engine is it's completely cool. I opened it up to try to clean out the stuff. It's Sorry, is, is there anything I can do? It just does that, are. yeah. Just the worst part is it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position for the future. I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Yeah, so... Dr. Octavius has basically ALS. American Sign Language. <laughs> oh, wait... <laughs> Wait, no, that's ASL. <laughs> <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> Ignore that. Ignore that blunder. I'm not tired at all. Not both tired. One of us didn't stay up and the other one didn't didn't go like work late yesterday or anything. <laughs> How was work? <laughs> Got that go. Uh, about as well as it usually goes, so not not too great. Right. And I have to go in on Wednesday, which is my day off and payday. So, but I only have to go in for three hours. Not so, not too big a deal. My my manager is on vacation again. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Genius. Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Gallium. Genius.
Was that up or down that you just turned it? I pressed it. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to figure out what way you're... Oh. I was trying to press it down by one. Oh, okay. Just because I saw on the screen that it may have picked up a bit more. Um, Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. Yeah. If we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Um, yep. Alter his personality. We need and to there you go. Care. And alter his personality. They're setting it up. How did he get that one set up? <laughs> <laughs> right. Did but, Did you look at uh Did you look at all of Otto's gear? I saw you uh, flipping around his goggles. I, I saw the goggles. I mean, you saw the goggles. You didn't see the rest of it. I I, guess. You're right. I didn't see the rest of it. Mm, there's that. Because I went immediately here because I thought you know a little cutscene would happen where someone barges in. Nope. Um, oh, so this is the arm that broke apart, right? Like, that's what it looked like? No, that's not the arm that broke apart. Oh, that's apart. not the... Oh, yeah, yeah, you mean the one that he was juggling with? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, because it was like, this is either the arm, because it's got an arm down there, and that's the fingers, and that's kind of like the stuff, or it was the thing that went into his, into the back of the helmet. Sensor. The thing. Yep. The... Glad we had Peter work on it because we knew nothing was going to go wrong if Peter works on it. Yeah, pretty much. Peter's um, starting to suspect. Oh. He hides it, but I can tell. Yeah, it's just about how. Knows the um, hmm, I now, can... if you keep looking around before you leave, you'll um, see some other Doc, interesting I'm sorry, stuff. My aunt just uh, around where you found the goggles, I believe. So over here. Because uh, the goggles were. I'll be back in a few hours. Well, because the goggles were right there. Okay, so turn to the left a little bit. I believe it was somewhere around this area near where Otto's working. Uh, to the right. To the right. Yeah, there should be around this desk. There should be some more stuff. Okay. There's the goggles right there. The goggles. So, all right. So behind you, maybe over. I know it's somewhere. There it is. There it is. What is this, Doc? Look at that. I've never seen this type of material. Would you believe it's for welding? It provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross. Look familiar. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what's gonna happen. Yep. So. It's even got the the end bits. Yep. Now he's got the goggles. What else is he missing? I think that's it. I yeah. Nice hairstyle, but I mean, like, we're going with we're not going with like fancy one. <laughs> we're not making him fancy or anything, so I don't think. Yeah, he's gonna put on a wig. He's like, this wig helps me. Uh, this wig energizes my thought process, making. <laughs> It makes me look fabulous, which puts me in a slightly better mood. <laughs> which makes me think faster. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Here we go. So, now I get to ask you a Spider-Man question. Oh. Spider-Man question. What's that on the map? That's not the question, but that is a question. It's a Taskmaster test. You follow Hi, and destroy man. drones. It's yeah. not very fun if okay. you're not good way. at web swinging. Well, I'm not going to go do it. Because the mission popped up. Yep. But anyway, so... Spider-Man. Yep. Wait, hold on. I'm going to start off the conversation. Tony Stark. Tony Stark. Millionaire. Yes. Lives in the tower somewhere over there. Maybe. Yeah, some, somewhere over there. I don't yeah. know my direct. Uh, north northeast, there. right. Uh, yeah, somewhere, somewhere, to somewhere in this place. Millionaire has a suit. Yep. Saves saves the city, and basically runs Avengers. Yep. It's kind of the the goal. Oh yeah. Spider Man has superpowers. It is really smart. Yep. But is dirt poor. Yep. Right. Like, that's the way Spider-Man should be. He shouldn't be, like, a millionaire. He shouldn't be, like, having all this money. He should be, like, the poor person because you're, he's your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Yep. And? 
I was, just, I was honestly expecting you to be like, no, I think he should like have some money. I was like, oh. Well, no, because uh, part of what makes Spider-Man so likable is his relatability. And I mean, you take away the relatability, you have another millionaire hero who is separated from the people. How's he going to be a friendly neighborhood Spider-Man if he doesn't understand the neighborhood? It's the same basic principles with superheroes as it is with politicians. Why would you want a superhero who doesn't understand your struggles to come save the day? You just made your right? Right. I mean, it I was makes very little sense. So having someone who's supposed to be grounded and rooted in the community suddenly be richer than everyone in the community combined, it, it wouldn't make sense. I just asked because I was on the internet and I was like, someone's like, headcanon was that like, Peter had a lot of money to him. No. And I was like, that doesn't make sense. Like, I understand that you wanted to, like, you, he, you know, he probably, like, went to school and did something. Yeah. Um, but at the same time, he's just using all his resources to essentially fight. Yeah. Um, I wouldn't mind eventually seeing a Spider-Man who's on in the years, like, 30, 40, even 50 years old, who has some degree of money, like, comfortable living kind of money. Um, but not millionaire. But not millionaire, no. I really like the claw tips. <laughs> You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. No, that's you, Miles. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. That was really brave. Unless I'm wrong. Maybe he's the ultimate Spider-Man. I don't remember. Okay. okay, but what if there aren't any around? He's got you there. Well, you he's got you, you there, Pete. Swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time, but when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought right on the Brooklyn Bridge? <laughs> Perfect example. He's a super the fan. Bigger? The question... Okay. Did they know about all his suits? Okay, like, did the Weekly Times, like, go, so Okay, this is Spider-Man. Like, because I'm in a different suit. Like, I'm in a Probably. completely different suit. Well, I mean, you still look like Spider-Man, though. You got a spider on the chest, you got the eyes, and you're still fighting crime. I imagine people would take issue or think that it's a different Spider-Man if you're wearing a different suit and you start beating people up, you know? <laughs> but you're still doing the same stuff, swinging around the city, fighting right. crime. But just and it looks similar enough. You think there's like... You think the, inter uh, the internet doing this game, and people are like, so here's my... Um, Spider-Man suit concept art and whatnot. Yeah. <laughs> like Spider-Man just like on the web one day is like, hmm, that looks pretty interesting. <laughs> I mean, I guess, but like, wouldn't that be like someone tries to sue Spider-Man then? <laughs> For taking their suit? I mean, I guess, I guess the idea would be like, you can use this if you want, it'd be cool to see. I also imagine the like, people that would make it are like young people that would be like, I made this. And so it'd be like colored in like crayons and whatnot. Oh, yeah. And then like Peter kind of likes it and just makes it. Like makes a real suit out of it. Yeah, that would be You're awesome. Not believe like, I just missed it wasn't like, Karn. <laughs> Miles just called Peter <laughs> about meeting Spider-Man. Yeah, Peter's totally like swinging around right now. Cool. Later. Oh, he didn't call Peter. He called friend. Called friend. Oh, Mark. Dude, Dude, thank you. Give that man, give that man some money, or just take the cup from him and punch him. <laughs> I guess you could be like a really awful person, <laughs> like throw him into traffic. We could make Miles really bad. Um. Uh, police blockade. That's a green taxi. Let's get in it. Let's steal it. <laughs> let's steal let's it. just let's just leave. Let's... That would be horrible if they got Miles Morales the only black character that's playable, and they're like, let's just turn it into GTA now. <laughs> you could just steal things. I'd be like, really? Come on. That's some roadblock. That's gonna be heavy. I'm traffic. actually really glad that they don't do the Rockstar Games style thing where you can just take people's cars and stuff. I mean, I know it's a Spider-Man game, so you don't have to. But I like that they they don't like. 
push the open world onto the regular people. Right. Like, the foot traffic missions aren't... It's gonna take forever. Just continue. I was looking at quick the mask. I'm, I'm looking in their eyes, trying to, trying to... Yeah, yeah, no. Hold L2. Little hackery could do the trick. <laughs> That's how hacking works. I mean... I can't believe I mean, you're gonna have to go, though, quick. I, I mean, as a person that understands hacking, that, it can work that way. Yeah. Also, I assume I'm in our stealth mission. I also assume I'm safe here. Yes, you are in a stealth mission. And yes, you're safe right there, but you're Can gonna have to... Yeah. So I just hack. Like, that's Miles' that, that's thing? Your, yeah, that's your shtick. Okay. There's not that many Miles missions, though. I feel like there's gonna be a couple more later on, like in DLC. Because they didn't have that many. And they set up, like, a whole new mechanic for it, you know? Oh, shoot. You better hurry. <laughs> I listen. I saw the boxes, and I was like, "This is gonna hurt me if I miss." Uh, am I just going out? Yeah, just keep keep going. Okay. Yeah. For a second, I thought I had to climb. No. Because you can slide under that. Or crawl under the gate that. on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I'm glad I don't. It's not like you have to crouch and walk, anything like that. Okay. It's yeah. Straight up, like just press this button. I gotta distract. You. Um, did you see? Yeah, stab. Right uh, that hacking target. But can I? Okay. For a moment, I thought it, he was gonna pop up his head. I'm dead. Uh, yeah. Oh, you really are. Oh dear, dear. All right. You good? Go, 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 go. I don't trust you. I don't trust me either. Yep. Was I seen by him or was I seen by someone else? You were seen by the guy that was like way back there, I think. Okay. Yeah, you gotta distract sure. the guy and go to the right, not to the left. The left is gonna get you killed. Or rather. Wait, so. Yeah. Wait, no, that's what I did to the right. You mean go to the left? No, I mean distract the guy. Distract him? Yeah, and then go to the right. Like when he's distracted and looking over there. Still didn't work. Okay. That's good. It might work. Might, 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 it might, it might, oh, <laughs> it <God>. might. <laughs> oh, you can you can hack that one too. Switch so further back. The left, the left, the red box. Oh, huh? Who's there? run over there, run over there. Your six, there we go. I don't have a lot of time. Nope. Wrong way. Yep. Okay. I don't feel safe here. No. Uh, but... Oh. oh, truck. Quick. What? Truck. Oh. Get the truck. And, you yep. Me. I'm invisible. Right. Okay. You're oh. just gonna have to make a run for it. Where? Over the fence. Over the gate. Stay alert. Hey. Damn it. Darn it. I was actually really curious, because I was yeah, behind the trash can. It also looked like I could have gone. No, you couldn't. Um, you, I'm pretty sure you have to make a run for it through there. <laughs> and you just have to be way quicker all right. on the drive. Ah, I'm back here. Ah, all the way back. Okay, but now we know red box. So if I hit that, and then he walks over there, and then I hit this. Yeah. And he'll be like, what's that? No. Being really gutsy over here. I wonder. Okay. No. So he's over there. He's gonna be distracted by the box. Yeah. No. That guy. Truck. And when he turns. Oh, me. Uh, I already have yeah. one. I can Okay. Over. Yeah, that one's a really close one. But As it should be. Hey, yep. Yeah. Alright, so made it over. Uh, yeah, almost there. And I'm calling my mom, being like, ah, oh, everything's fine. You don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. Choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. It's true. It's the guy said. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? And just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey. I love you so much. 
You should go play some basketball. It's a, it's a staple of every streetwise Marvel movie. I'm, I'm trying. I thought there was a or TV show. Thought there. I thought they were in a gate. It's a it's, it's a just, New York City staple. You got to play some basketball until someone scouts you for your greatness. Gah, uh, get me in there. What? I can be the next. Sony's gonna hire me. They're gonna put me in a game. Uh. That's how Black Panther started. That was a good movie. I was really confused by that shirt. It just says hype. I, I, Are you not hyped for this game? I thought, it's, <laughs> I thought it had the PS logo on it. The PlayStation logo. Oh yeah, that would be pretty good. It would one. be funnier if it had like a Nintendo logo on it. <laughs> it's, <a> Nintendo. <laughs> it's like, really? <laughs> I wonder if... You just see, are games allowed to put other people's companies in? Or do they have to pay? It, well, you, you, they have to pay licensing. I mean... Or be sponsored, technically. I mean... But I don't think Nintendo would go for it. <laughs> hey, uh, sorry I'm late now. It, would, it sure would be funny to see Aunt May playing a Switch game or something. <laughs> playing, playing Wii Sports Tennis. Fun. <laughs> like at the Feast Center. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee, all right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you, is that cool? Oh man, two main characters in the same room? Who do I get to play as? Yes. <laughs> It's gonna pull a GTA 5 where I have to constantly switch between the two. Yep. Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Delicious. Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, neutrons. hadrons? Subatomic. Oh. Fits. Good one, kid. There's Ernie. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Miles was kind of like holding the, the container, and I was like, he's just pouring the coffee on the ground. <laughs> yeah. It just keeps going, turning it. You gotta make it up. Or, could be a loose coax cable. Alright. Be my guest. Huh? <laughs> it's the protons. Don't you already dislike this guy? They do a good job of making him not likable. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as what reports a, emerge that he used... What a very convenient news broadcast. Or inconvenient, I guess. Hey, new kid. I'm empty here. <laughs> yep. Not even like a please or anything. Get himself blown up. Hey Ernie, I see you've met Miles. He's gonna yeah. be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. <laughs> That's a really good save right there. Great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you can see him back a little hard. <laughs> he's like. I'm sorry, I just said your dad was stupid and horrible. Sorry about you. And I know good. Come on, Miles. See if Aunt May needs a hand in the kitchen. Okay, so I don't mind that the subtitles were telling me like what the news was saying, but at the same time, it kind of made it a bit hard to read. Miles? Yeah, nice to I don't know. You. Grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Aunt May really does look like my grandma yeah. in this. <laughs> like... Thanks for that back there. Does that mean... Like, like, well, like the Sam Raimi Aunt May looked like one of my grandmas, and this one looks like the other. <laughs> it's like... They just base <laughs> the character. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've got someone stalking me and taking pictures of my grandmothers and going, all right, this is what... This is, this is roughly what Aunt May needs to look like. <laughs> I don't know where they got the one for Spider-Man Homecoming. <laughs> But <laughs> <laughs> don't know where they got that one, but the others or the Andrew Garfield one. <laughs> I haven't seen that one, so don't know. I, I don't remember that one actually, to be honest. I only saw the Amazing Spider-Man one and two once each. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I hate them. I I don't actually hate the Andrew Garfield movies. I had a lot of fun with them. I mean, they're they're not they're not not really good. I like Andrew Garfield's performance in them. Yeah, but. 
they they have a lot of issues. A lot of the same issues, in fact, that the Sam Raimi movies had, but in different ways. Um, and a lot of issues that Homecoming didn't manage to have, thank goodness. Am I ready for the next one? You bet I'm ready for the next one. It better be coming out soon. It's not. It's coming out in like six months. Are you ready for Into the Spider-Verse? Oh, I am super ready for that one. I know, but I'm so ready for it. Is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. There's a huge plot twist involved with that. <laughs> I feel better already. Its name is actually the antidote. Its name is Barack Obama. <laughs> president. president. For, former, former president, Former president. Former Democrat president. I don't... He kind of looks like Obama. Well, when the camera was look. shaking, if you squint your eyes really hard, he looks like Obama. I just want to know, why is that, like, a good thing to do? Why? why would you handcuff something to your... Like, why would you handcuff the brain? I feel like every time they do that, in movies or in games, something bad's about to happen. Well. Exhibit. <laughs> A lot of times with the handcuffing a briefcase, it's to deter like more minor threats, like people who aren't willing to dismember or kill someone mm. for it. Because like obviously it's not gonna stop someone who's gonna shoot you and cut your arm off, right? Right. But it will stop a thief who just wants to take it. Yeah, is this guy it. gonna break his arm? Because like you're gonna have to kill me to get it, right? Or, or in this case they're <laughs> just gonna keep him. He's gonna keep him. Because, you know, this is a world where they're strong enough to do that, I guess. It's a really big angle. Or maybe yeah. it's just a camera angle. They're gonna come up to the Walmart TLE section where I work, and I'm gonna be like, get <laughs> out of here. They're gonna be like, here. can we get an oil change? And be yeah, like, they're gonna be like, right. can we change these tires? I'm gonna be like, I don't think I can even think about lifting those tires. I can't even lift that vehicle. I can barely lift pickup truck tires here. When, when uh, someone with a pickup truck in the state of Texas has tires that they need mounted on their vehicle, it's almost always going to be like 50 pound tires. It's so stupid. Oh, <laughs> See, look how massive that is. Oops. No, it's huge. It's really huge. Wait, I was... Uh... There you go. I was actually on that. I was like, there's no way. Ooh, you got him. Sort of. No. What? Oh, triangle. Charge jump time. Oh, come on. I'm not good at the charge jump. Or I feel like I'm not doing it. Uh, it, it takes a little practice to start doing. I have no idea. Camera, camera, camera. Yeah. I love how they're like strolling through Silver Sable mercenary checkpoints and like Silver Sable's practically not even doing anything. <laughs> no, they're sending the cop cars. Yeah, but it's like, guys, come on, you got all these watchtowers, you can't fire some rockets. Oh, wait, no, he just said there's a biological. I mean. <laughs> They're not gonna get I, I also... Never mind. <laughs> I mean you need to clear the guys in the trucks before I go after the range. Yep. I mean we're also assuming that the biological weapon will like destroy if it was if it could like it will do something bad if it's destroyed. Yeah. Um well it probably will. Probably will. Oh no. Oh no. I feel so floaty right now. Is that so? I, I mean, I do. I feel really floaty whenever I jump like that on this vehicle. Yeah. We're going so fast that it's just not working. Oh. Okay, I thought it was going into a cutscene. It was. I couldn't move. But you're fine. See? You may have been knocked up. 
I may have been knocked off, but I'm still on. <laughs> You're still here. All is well. Here we go. Oh no, quick time events, my nightmare. Bulletproof glass being smashed. Is this truck made of like paper mache? Uh. <laughs> Why do you say that? Because everything kind of just peeled off? Yeah. The door just fell off like nothing. I mean, I guess the door's got to be like really heavy. I mean, I thought he just like oh he opened it up, so I just assumed that he cut it off as well. He like ripped it off the hinges or something. Oh. I mean, I guess that could happen as well. Yeah. Ow. And now you're a serial killer. And just like that, now I'm the killer. What? That's the big honest, plot twist. I You're the main villain. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. Um. So I'm, I'm in a dream. I was waiting for you. Pretty hard. You never came. Where were you? Is this real? We're in my mind. It was Stop a teleporting like so two feet away. Had to die. No heroes to save me. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. Oh, I realize where we are now. Yep. We're at City Hall. You're going the wrong way. Ignore the car. You're supposed to go to actual City Hall up there. And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be exiled with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Yeah, I mean, Norman Osborne is, like, basically the worst. Put on the mask. Like, one of the worst people on ever, us. but... I mean, sure, sure, I'll just, just move forward now. Yeah. Put, I'll just put it on right now. Just... It, it's floating there like a Legend of Zelda item. Of course I want to put it on. <laughs> uh, now, now I get the... Oh, here. I mean, I can use them. I just didn't save them. Yeah. I wanted that pizza more. Like, it's not because I didn't, I couldn't. It just literally, suddenly, a bomb exploded. I, I can't save everyone. Look, I gotta have my pizza time. If innocent people have to die so I can have pizza time, then that's just how it's gotta be. Ow. You gotta, you gotta break a few eggs to make an omelet, capiche? Okay, so I'm not saying the black suit was a bad idea, I'm simply saying that maybe right now it's a bad idea. Yeah, I guess. You're like, nah, 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 it's always I, I don't see your point here. <laughs> you can usually tell when, when something's going wrong, right? <laughs> right, ah! Like there. And I wasn't able to do this at all. I'm supposed to just be beating these people up, right? Am I supposed to be able to use Spider Bro right now? Yeah, he made it in here. Sweet. Yeah, that's me, so you gotta, you gotta find him. Never! My like button mashing is too strong. Me is, uh, who said that in a video game? I mean, like a million people. I think it was in Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, pretty sure that was Kingdom Hearts 2, final boss. Maybe. Oh no. Do that, you won't abandon Martin Lee. What? I like how it, like, goes upwards. I like how I have to fling the rocket at it. It automatically trails into the center to hit. Yeah. It's really nice, isn't it? 
<laughs> oh hey, how can we be right in front of the city? Yep. <laughs> Destroy the bank. Wait, we were right in front of City Hall. They escaped. They, wow, he did that really fast. They also cleaned up the area really fast. Yeah. I don't think that was City Hall. Okay, it looked like it. After all the imagery that I was Although, just... Although, even, even if it was, like, they, they had the funeral for Jefferson, so it had to have been a few weeks. Right. So. You're a popular guy. <laughs> There's a pothole on I-35. You know how long that's been there? Okay, you got, you got a good point, but this is like fictional. This is like fictional New York. I'm gone. What? what is, I don't know. Russian, I guess. Save people, but you just make it. The Russian. This is your fault. My fault. He was under your protection. You really need two of those. That's a really good response there is uh pull out the guns. Pull out two guns. When someone when someone disagrees. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'm I mean, I'm with her in being like, you gotta pull, like you, you you can like attack someone, but at the same time Bio weapon just was released into the public, you may not wanna 